Coming into this season, I'm not going to lie. I looked at the rotation and I was like, I don't know. I don't know. Because admittedly, last year, you're in the pen Mm -hmm. and your ERA was five plus, right? So I see you as a starter and I'm like, well, I don't know. I don't know how to feel about this rotation. Were you one of the tweeters? I don't know if I he's the tweeter. I don't know if I tweeter. He's a tweeter. He, he is trouble. a tweeter. I don't think he particularly <laughs> tweeted about that. He was more in trouble. We're gonna have this guy in a few months. I don't want to say anything too bad about him. <laughs> it's easy to point to Rob Childress and be like, Childress effect. I want to give you some credit too, because ultimately you're the one that's going out there. You took this monumental step. Did you change anything as far as like your approach physically, mentally? Like, did you do anything different? No, and that's like, that's what's crazy. Like, I love Childress, and he helped me out a ton just in terms of like, he was more of a guy that was in my corner, whereas like younger guys, he's kind of more hands on with. But like me, like coming off the summer I had, like I've pitched in college. He was really good at just kind of like, you do your thing. Like, I'll give you like, we can bounce ideas off each other if you do it. Great. Otherwise, this is a lot of for the like the younger guys. Like a coach, like you always take their ideas, but like it's your career. He was really good at understanding that with me. Like, I'd found something that worked for me in the summer. And he kind of just said, you know, you do what you were doing in the summer and I'll just be here. You got to do certain things my way. But in terms of what you want to do, like throwing wise and stuff, that's you. Like, I didn't add a new pitch. I didn't do anything differently. I just just threw, I guess. Like you walk people, you're going to give up runs. And I was like, why would I walk people? Like that's the one thing I can actually control. Right. Don't throw it over the plate. If you hit it four times, and I guess, you know what? Tip the cap. But I also think I took a big step realizing how hard hitting is. That's what I think on the mound. If I hang a curveball, it's still way harder to hit it than it is for me to throw it. That's kind of what I went up there thinking. Just hitting's way harder than me throwing the ball over the plate. The Scherzers, the Bob Gibsons, the Bulldog mentality, especially if you're a Friday night starter like yourself, I'm going after you. I'm going to trust my stuff. If you can, hit it. You have to think you're better than the guy in the box. Even if you're not, I mean, you have to think it.